Hi, I'm Andrew Kuo of Cadence Design Systems. Welcome to Security Tech Tips. Today, we will bring you another installment of how to build and verify your multi-gigabit serial link to meet industry compliance standards. Our video today will show you how complex 3D structures on printed circuit boards can be optimized using Security 3D Full Wave Field Solver technology. Utilizing Cadence Allegro and Security technology, complex structures found on high-speed serial links such as VR rates can be designed in Allegro PCB, optimized for return loss and insertion loss using Security 3D analysis technology, and then the optimized structure can be updated in the PCB design tool without having to redraw the structure. No longer will design teams have to spend hours or even days making sure all the details of a 3D structure are properly updated based on a third-party field solver's optimization. Instead, PCB design teams can take advantage of Allegro security integration and simply place the optimized structure on the PCB as well as reuse it on the current or future PCB designs. When you upgrade your PCB design flow to follow the Allegro Security High-Speed Structure Optimization Methodology, you will build reliable products faster and pass standards-based electrical compliance tests ahead of your competition. In today's video, you will see us utilize the Allegro Security SI Base and the System Serial Link Analysis option. To learn more about these products, visit us at www.cadence.com Now, I will turn it over to my colleague, Charlie Shi. Thanks, Anyu. I am pleased to introduce Sigurdi 3D EM High Speed Structure Optimizer for VIA Optimization and Serial Link Designs. 3D EM HSSO integrates with Allegro for a complete high speed VIA structure design and analysis flow. A VIA structure is a reusable element that contains VIA pad stack, trace segments, as well as anti pad clearance. VIA structures can be created in Allegro and saved to a library, which you can import into 3D EMHSSO flow for optimization and analysis. Based on that analysis, you can modify the VIA structure as needed, and all of the objects in the VIA structure can be set up for a parameter sweep. The tool automatically generates then simulates cases based on parameter combinations. The tool also generates a helpful HTML report that summarizes cases that have passed and failed differential, insertion, and return loss criteria. You can back annotate your optimized designs for 3D EMHSSO to the Allegro PCB environment and easily refresh or replace the original VIA. Optimized VIA structures can even be reused for other channels. Let's switch to a demo using the high speed option in Allegro. Here, we'll create a high-speed VIA structure. Turn on the Cut Sea Lines by Rectangle option and select an area around the VIA that includes the pad stack and trace segments. Define the return path and save to a library. Now, Open the 3D EMHSSO flow and import the VIA structure that we created in Allegro. All of the options for the VIA structure are imported into the VIA wizard, and you can modify the VIA structures. Since the VIA structure we created didn't have ground VIAs surrounding them, we'll add two additional ground VIAs, one at the top and the other at the bottom. Now it's ready to join the VIA pattern for optimization analysis. In the 3D view, you can see there are two probes, one on top and another pair on the bottom. Next, we'll specify the sweeping parameters we want to simulate within. All of the objects in the VIA structure can be selected to define the sweeping parameter. You can set up parameters through the layout menu or by right clicking on a parameter in the table and specifying its range and the total points. 
You can choose any specific one, or you can group them to bulk specify the parameter. We'll select the trace width as well as the anti-pad clearance. You can also bundle two sweeping parameters together to conveniently list them under the same parameter value. Reviewing the parameters we set up in the previous stage shows a total of nine cases created. You can also uncheck any of the cases you don't want to include in the analysis. Now we can set up the network parameter. You set up the boundary and mesh algorithm for evaluation by changing the reference impedance, frequency, and the geometry. Once you hit Start Simulation, all of the cases will be simulated in batch mode, and the simulation results will be displayed. You can import the insertion and return loss criteria to determine which cases are optimized and meet your design requirements. And there is an HTML report to show you which cases are optimized. Then we can switch back to the layout and select the case we want to back annotate in Allegro. Once switched back to your layout design in Allegro, Replace the original VIA structure with the optimized one from the HSSO flow. Since we added ground VIAs in the HSSO flow, we need to specify a ground net for them. We can reuse the VIA structure for the other circuits in the SIRDES channel by selecting the previously used VIA structure. Again, don't forget to specify the ground return path. After placing the VIA structure, connect it to the proper trace segments. Move and slide the VIA structure and traces to optimize your design. The complete high-speed structure design and analysis flow using 3D EM, HSSO, and Allegro can eliminate the time-consuming and error-prone process of repeatedly redrawing optimized VIA structures. Back to on you. Thank you for watching another edition of Security Tech Tips. For information on the products used in today's video, click on the links below or contact your local Cadence Sales Representative or Cadence Channel Partner.